What up, J and A two? So today you're gonna be getting ready with us while we tell a story time about our homecoming experience. But this was basketball season. Okay, so it was the night before the homecoming game. This is basketball season, right? Yeah. And okay, so we we like. It was a Q versus Kappa basketball game. And after the basketball game, it's going to turn into a party. So, I don't know why, but we went to the Q versus basketball, the Q versus Kappa basketball game. Not like I don't know why, like we did, why we went, but nobody was there. We was like, it was like how many people in there? It was like five people. Five people in there, and we had a bottle. She so, we hurt. did a little bit before we went in. And we went in, we saw how much people were, we were blown, so we like, we just went So we just went back into the car. the car, and we just drunk in the car. We were just sitting in the car, it was like, nobody, nobody in there, so let's just go sit in the car. And there was some cues, was it Capos. Or Capos? There was some caps from other school, they seen us drinking in the car, so they like, oh, okay. Let's go to that car. Yeah, we're just chilling and like stuff, but we, mind you, we all like pretty fucked up now. We, did, we had a whole bottle to ourselves, it's four of us. And it was a big bottle like this big. He was on the line. So, mind you, the party is didn't even happen yet. The party didn't even happen yet. So, we're drinking and next thing you know, we dancing outside the car. We see all these people like coming around us, you know. Cause we the only people there too. Cause there's just a basketball game. And all the cues and the was there, but that was it. So, then next thing you know, I get I don't I'm not blacked out, blacked out drunk, but you know when you get real drunk, it, everything goes like pictures. <laughs> so next thing I know, I'm in the passenger seat. Lex is the driver, and then a Q is driving us. <laughs> I wake up and I'm like, what the heck? And I'm just like, I was I don't know why I was grabbing the wheel and everything. I don't know what was going on. I was scared. So then I was too drunk to drive, so this cute said he'll drive us back to the dorms. Yeah, cause cause we coming to the party, cause they're like, oh y'all gotta go get dressed for the party and stuff like that. We thinking we going to the party. We <laughs> don't even bros. make it yet. There's the cops behind us while the Q is driving. And I don't know what's wrong with her. She started screaming. I guess she was a little drunk. She started screaming like, pull over, pull over. He's a Q. She keep telling him to pull over at the cabin house. They don't do that. <laughs> but I don't know. I don't remember where we dropped her off at. I was drunk. In front of the cabin house. So oh, then next thing you know, he drops us off at the building. His friends was following him. So he like, we gonna see y'all, we gonna see y'all. They probably yeah. knew they wasn't going to see us too. Yeah, you won't see us. So, this is when I get out the car and I swear to you, I'm blacked out drunk. Blacked out. I don't remember not, nothing like that's. I'm done telling the story. It's <laughs> okay, so I go to Jalen's dorm, Jalen Mode Milan dorm, to make sure like everybody gets there fine. So, I'm walking with Jalen... I remember you wasn't, no, no, no. I take Jalen to her dorm first, thinking, okay, I'm going to sit her in there. She's going to be good. And plus, her roommate was in. So she had dirt on her pants, and she comes in just loud. Ooh, I'm just like, girl, shh, shh, shh. So Mike helps me take her to the room, and I'm just like, thank you, because she was just falling everywhere, and I just couldn't hold her up by myself. So Jalen's like, um, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. And I'm just like, no, get to your room. Get to your room. She was like, no, I'm not getting to my room until I get a kiss. I was like, bro. And she was like, Mike, don't you love me? I know you love me. He, she was like, I'm not going to my room until he tells me he loves me. Did he say it? Yeah, he said, I love you. Did I know? <laughs> yeah, you went to your room. But, okay, so I'm thinking it's all done. She gets in her room, and she straight unlock her in her room, her actual room. So I'm thinking, okay, she's not going to be able to get out. She's straight. This girl, I, but I'm already walking out. This girl um, walks out, but I hear her RD yelling when, when I'm like outside. So I'm just thinking, oh, maybe it's like somebody else. And she was yelling at Jalen because Jalen went outside, took off all her clothes. It was just wild. A mess. A mess. Like, that was the most drunk I ever been. So, <laughs> this part, I don't know because my RD told me. So, um, 
she's taking me, pulling my clothes back on, take, and then she takes me, she tries to take me to my room. I have a high bed, so she couldn't get me up on my bed because I, I was fighting her, and I just, she couldn't get me up there. So she did take me to her room, and then I fall, and I hit my head real bad. So I guess she thinking, I, when I hit my head, I'm asleep. I'm knocked out. I threw up a lot in her room. It was everywhere. I'm knocked out. So next thing you know, I guess she calls my mom, and then she also calls the aunt, the police. The police come. They don't want to arrest me because, um, I don't know. I guess because they know it's college, it's homecoming. So they didn't want to arrest me. So they called the ambulance. So, um, I don't remember the ride there. None, none of that. I and woke up. Before uh -huh. the ambulance, before she got in the ambulance, somebody was telling me there's an ambulance at building three. I'm like, for real? But I just had this feeling. I just had this feeling. I was like, bro, it's Jalen. I don't know what kind of feeling it was, but I just had it. So um, my friend George, he comes get me from his car because I couldn't, I, I didn't want to walk over there. I probably what if he did all that and it wasn't even me? At least I tried to check. Yeah. So he comes and gets me and I'm walking and I'm asking the police. I was like, excuse me, what happened? He was like, a girl um was drunk really bad. I said, what's her name? He said, Jalen. I was like, ah, I gotta get to the hospital. I was like, where's the hospital? I'm sitting there finna cry. You know, drunk emotions. <laughs> and um, he just like, yeah, she, she like very intoxicated. I'm just thinking, damn, did we really drink that much? I'm gonna call my ex, see if he can take me to the hospital, drive my car or whatever. But I had to drive to him in order for me to go. When I tell y'all that was the most focused I ever been on the road, <laughs> I was like this. Like, I was so fucked up. I did not know how I made it. So, we go to the hospital, and Jalen's like passed out. And I'm just thinking, okay, she just passed out, drunk. She's straight. And we just sitting there, my mom freaking out, calling. I'm like, I got this. I got this under control. My granny calling me. I'm like, granny, I got this under control. I got this. Me and my ex here, we got this. And he just like, bro, everybody overreacted. She just he was scared because he bought the liquor for us. <laughs> so he's like, he's trying to make sure, like, I'm really. When I tell y'all this man won't give us no more liquor to this day, he will not. He will not. But um. Which I understand, because I probably win, but yeah. Ew. I woke up in the hospital. I woke up, my mama's staying in there with a phone, recording everything, um, mad, my granny screaming. But I'm in and out, like, so I woke up in the hospital. I see Alexis and my mom there. Her boyfriend was there, but I mean, at the time. We, we left but that night, so I came back that morning. I didn't see them until that, yeah, like that morning. And mind you, that's a homecoming game day, so I'm like, Jill, you gotta get up out this hospital, girl. Man, I had so many bruises. But I'm like, Jalen, you straight? And she like, yeah, I'm straight. So I'm like, cool. So I don't need nobody overacting no more. Jalen good. That's the person we worried about. She good. We all good then. And so she gets out like, she gets out during the daytime. So we just all like, Ching. the game back in there again for the game. But I couldn't even drink. Yeah. For the game. First, I was kind of scared because everybody was scaring me. And then second, it was like, I, it like, yo, stomach, I didn't want none. Yeah, it like, probably felt very weird. I feel, smell of alcohol probably even. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smell yeah. made me sick. Everything, like, yeah. it just was not. And yeah, once you get sick like that, it just be like, oh, alcohol. Yeah. But, um, so we go to the game. We all looking good. Mind you, the game, we really didn't even make it to the game, honestly. It took we us didn't. Over. Why? Why? We, there so we was kind of ready early, but Mo and Milan were not ready. Oh. So we was waiting on them. And then Never we went to go again. I'm going on time no matter what my friends are doing. Because, <laughs> yeah, they I don't know what they were doing. They was taking so long. So that day. long. That's why I make it like. I and then we had a lead again to go buy a ticket. And so we, we bought a ticket to the wrong party. We bought. Us four bought tickets to the wrong party. They went to. Them two went to one party, we went to another party, but it was straight because I think our, I think both parties was lit, but yeah, I, think I, think we had, ours. I think ours was, more people was at our party. Yeah. But it was still been better to be with your friends. Yeah. But yeah, it was two, two different parties. That was really it. Like, we had, we turned up. The game was lit. Yeah, the game, it was a lot of people too. I was just mad I wasn't in there to pop out. Yeah, we look cute. I don't know. I don't know if we have pictures because if we if we have pictures, I'll show them now. Oh, we got 
it, yeah. But yeah, so, but the game was cool. Everything was cool. Yeah, I have nobody fun. really knew. It was a memory. Nobody, you know? nobody really knew that was me. Yeah. Everybody was like, talk. People was coming to me, talking to me, telling me the story. But Chris won't let us forget it, man. We have more drunk story though. Yeah. Believe in me. We <laughs> do. We got more drunk stories, videos. Oh, I can talk about um the time. But this was before that. The time of the thing. Now we drink in moderation. At least if that day didn't t teach us nothing and taught us that. Yeah, I think no mileage. We all know our yeah. We all know our limits now. Wasn't it a up? beef sausage? It was sausage. <laughs> Drunk in love I love bacon I be probably baking too much But I like looking mad You know what I'm saying? <laughs> probably bacon, bacon too much Yeah I like looking mad Some of these girls be looking dewy It's not my life I get mad Can y'all see that? I got dewy mad. That's just my, for my darker Cause I know y'all like but this is my dirt. This is a lace. Yeah. I'll say this. But it's the brand. Why did I say do it? Oh, say do it plus look. Okay. What else have a homecoming? Y'all homecoming was fun. Though. We coming up with new things. We got. We gonna. We coming up with new collab. We coming up with. Like we coming up with new content. We coming up with. So it's like, and we want our videos to be very like have good quality. So you know, especially for the people. We're coming up with like real good things, especially for the people that's here now, because this is really like the beginning, and it can only get better. I know it look like ashy, but you look ashy. That's how I like. It. You look ashy. You look good. And then, and then for like you got a little blanket right here, though. Yeah, right there. And then for like people that's light skin. Or brown skin, you know, whatever. I learned that using pink, I use pink Mary Kay. It's like, it's this blush, but it's not that blush. And I have a real, real blush, but I don't really like use it. But I learned that using this really makes you have like dimensions in your cheeks, like for real. Like, <laughs> So look, if you do it like, yeah, yeah. Do you see? Do you see the difference? I do. You may not. I do. But it's like we don't go nowhere without this face looking. On two. Hey, one. Wait, wait till y'all seen like when we was doing the prank stuff at home. It's because we be at home. At school, you gotta be on ten. You gotta pop up every time. You gotta be on team. So right. after that, it's time for the highlights. And we finna show you what we be highlighting. Okay, so now it's every, well, maybe not every girl's favorite part, but my favorite part, man, is the highlight. So let's show you every highlight. I still look at that shiny ass. Boys don't understand how they saw. I was talking to this boy on my makeup in front of him, and he was like, I put the highlight in. He was like, Oh, it look good. And I was like, Yeah, he said, Now rub it like in. And I said, What? He said, Rub it in, you know. So it's like just that part shining. I'm like, Dude, no, it's not. It's not how it goes. Sometimes I like to line my lip from because it's still got the uh, foundation on it. I still have my plump lips. Yeah. Say little bitch, you can fuck with me if you wanted to. These expensive, these is red bottoms, red bottoms, these is bloody shoes. Hit the school, I can get them both. I don't wanna choose, and I'm quick, cut a nigga off, so don't get cut.